Happening now, jurors are in the day two of deliberations in the case of a man accused of beheading his girlfriend with a semi sword in San Carlos. NBC Bay Area's Chris Sanchez joining us live from San Mateo County Courthouse in Redwood City with what might be going on in the jury room. So, Chris, these are some brutal accusations here. Yeah, this was a very brutal crime and it was witnesses witnessed by people. So we know that the jury has a lot to consider from this three week trial from that testimony of witnesses who saw that brutal crime as it unfolded to the suspects own behavior in the courtroom. Now, Jose Solano Landeta was described as nearly catatonic at times as the prosecution told the jury how he argued with his girlfriend, 27 year old Karina Castro, then retrieved a samurai sword from his car and attacked her. Landetta's attorney told the jury that the case wasn't really about who committed the crime, but why. And that why was what his attorney calls imperfect self-defense because Landetta is a paranoid schizophrenic who was a, threatened by the victim first, according to his attorney. Our legal analyst says that what Landetta was like in the courtroom will likely play into their decision. I think the jury is going to evaluate his behavior in terms of how they look at the defense case, particularly his claim of self-defense. When he was catatonic during the trial, non-responsive to the DA's questioning, I think that's something that uh, the jury is going to carefully look at. So this is day two of jury deliberations. Uh, they do, We don't know how long they are expected to deliberate, but when they reach a decision, we will update you on air and online at NBCBayArea.com. In Redwood City, Chris Sanchez, NBC Bay Area News.